hello my lovely people welcome back to my channel really creativity i'm here again to give you a simple head wrap tutorial using this and this okay so this is a net okay so i would like to say this one is not the soft one not that soft it's a bit hard okay yeah can you see how it's bouncing back <laughs> it's very hard it's not that soft and uh, this one is our lycra the stretchy one okay the stretchy okay so this is two years almost two years like sometimes it's two years sometimes not two years I don't know why these people do it like that but yes this is two years okay so now I'm going to do combination with this two okay but it's very easy to do it very easy okay all right so let's get right into the tutorial so if today is your first time seeing me you are so welcome okay if you like what i do please do subscribe remember to hit on your notification bell so that anytime i post you will be first to see it that's the only way you can learn on my page thank you <laughs> all right so what i'm going to do is i'm going to take this like this I want this to be short and this side is going to be long okay so I want to cross it on my head like this and then let me see what I can get some pleats let me see when I can get some pleats okay All right, so I'm going to take the side and cross it over like this. And then I'll pick this one and cross it over. You see how I've done it? And then I'll leave this one and then I'll come back and hold it like this. All right, so I want to take another pleat here. Okay. Okay, let me take another one again. All right, so I think it's enough. So now the back i'll just grab it like this to the side and i'll fold this one in like this The pleats are not that perfect, but I will rearrange it later. It doesn't have to be perfect, okay? Because it's stretchy fabric and it's not easy uh, pleating a stretchy fabric, okay? So don't worry if the pleating is not that perfect. You don't have to worry. You don't have to worry. <laughs> And don't you be afraid <laughs> okay so I'll take it like this and then take it round round and round and then I will tuck it in at this end you can even wrap your head like this even if you don't want the net to wahala you can wrap your head like this to church see mm. <laughs> yes you can wrap your head like this to church if you don't want the net or hala we are about to do okay so you can decide to leave it at this point it will be just okay to be fine <laughs> 
Okay, so now let's take our net. We are coming to do something very dramatic. <laughs> All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to fold the net like this. And then I will divide it into two equal parts like this. And then I'm going to use my band. You know me and band. We are like best friends. <laughs> so I'm going to tie the two together. Okay. Let me tie it well. Let me go again. Please don't forget to like the video if you like what I'm doing. Remember to comment. Your feedbacks are really, really important for me. Okay. Keeps me going. Keeps me moving. It gives me vim. <laughs> Alright, so at this point, look at that. So here you you have to decide you want it on top, you want it on the side or the side. So hmm, I want mine at the side like this. Okay. So I will just wrap it like this. I'm going to show you two ways you can do this. Okay. And then I'll take the side. I just want to cover this side up. And then we we'll leave the back like this. Let's tie a lot. Let's put them together like this. And then we're going to tuck it in at the back like this. Okay. Okay. So now that we have it like this, let's move to the next step. Next step is like this. Okay. So what I want is a tie. I just pin my hand. So I'll take this tie, throw it under like this, and I'll tie both together. I'll tie both together like this. Okay, at the back. like this and then you have our ribbon ready okay so now we are going to open it and then we are going to open the side and it will be like a fascinator on top you can t you can decide to take it you can make it a ribbon or you can take it round so i want to take my round i want mine to be round okay i want it to be round like this let's keep pulling so the reason why I use this net is because it's hard, it can really stand. When you use the soft one, it won't stand like this one. Okay, and you can have this in other colors, any color of your choice. Okay, so let's keep pulling. You pull, pull, pull. Yes. 
all right so now that we have it like this ready like fascinator uh i have to i want to push it back a bit yes at least we still have some place showing here so it's okay and here's the back here's the back all right so let's start our design so i have some feathers here you know these feathers you can get it even where they sell uh, uh i don't know how to put it shops that they sell uh things for those that do painting for case you know uh, i don't know you know what you can get this <laughs> this feathers okay and even those that sells fabrics and all that they even sell this feathers nowadays okay so you can just grab yourself some colors it comes with different colors blue red you know so i want to do combination with this red or better still if you have some chicken in the house you can color it out <laughs> But before you do that, you have to ask the chicken you know, mm -hmm, for the feathers and then you color it. <laughs> so I'm not going to put it in the middle like this. Okay, I'll put it in the middle like this. And I'll pin it. Okay. I want the red to be in the middle. Okay. We, we don't have that money to go and buy fascinator. So this one is home remedy. I'm showing you home remedy, okay? So if you have chicken in the house, it's good advantage. You, you can learn it. You can tell the chicken to learn you some feathers. And then you color it. Yeah, I want it to spread like this. Okay. So all that you do is you pin it inside it. You pin it inside it funny right <laughs> oh but yeah on a serious note you can get it uh, in the shops where they sell fabrics and uh, those that do artists 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 <laughs> don't do arts and all that you can get it so it's okay so at this point you can leave it like this and then you take it to your party your wedding <laughs> imagine having this in white mm. to be nice i'll do the white version for you guys to see i'll do the white version okay or tell me in the comment section which color do you want me to do <laughs> all right so you can even after this you can even put a brooch on it to give it more vibe i don't like the yellow let me see I want something small not too big let me see let me see i have some white small white brooch here yes and then you seal it in the middle so that nobody will see anything nobody will know nobody will know <laughs> then i'll pin it in it like that okay guys what do you think oh. <laughs> and then you are ready to go you can take it to your wedding or your special occasion okay so if you have some of this scarf this is another way you can slay it this another way you can rock it okay what do you think wow oh guys look at that <laughs> all right so if you like what we did today if you like what we did today please do subscribe so that you'll be having more of this you'll be seeing more of this beautiful head wrap tutorials and don't forget to hit on your notification bell it's very important okay it's always alerts you anytime i post new tutorial 
okay so remember to set it on before you leave okay do it now i mean now <laughs> please do that for me okay so let me have feedback on this what do you think is it giving what it's supposed to give are you going to give a try let me know all that in the comment section and let me know what color you want me to do next with the same tutorial what colors what color do you want me to do <laughs> oh i love it i can imagine myself in white like white with this i will surely do the white i will surely do the white but if i'm not able to do it remember the same procedure you use for the white okay so for the white you have to get a white scarf white net and then for the feathers you can choose colors maybe when you look at your attire or the dress that you're going to put on you think there are some beautiful colors in it you want to blend with the feathers you can also do that okay <laughs> I just love this. Look at that. Let me come closer. <laughs> Funny, right? Okay, so thanks for watching me. Those that have been having time to watch me, I'll never take you for granted. It's good seeing somebody watch me teach. Thank you so much for having the patience to watch to the end, okay? Thank you so much. And then see you in my next video. Let's all try to stay safe. Okay. See you in my next video. Okay. Bye. <laughs> okay. I'm loving this. I'm loving this. Looks like fascinator. Okay. So you can create your own simple fascinator at home that you can take to parties, weddings, naming ceremonies, you know, name them, okay? Imagine having other colors that is matching with your dress, with this style, this simple style. You're going to look amazing. <laughs> All right, so let me have feedback on this. Yes, the back. Here's the back. Here's the back the back and the side the front I want to give you every view on it so that you can see it well mm. and at the side like this we have our tiny plates wow this is cute so one thing I also want to say is you can take the net also you can take the net like this and roll net alone so this thing is like two in one okay you can rock it like this alone with your hair and this one too, you can rock it just this so it's like two in one two in one <laughs> all right so i'd like to leave you now and uh, let's all try to stay safe as usual let's do our best Alright, so let me leave you and see you in my next video. Bye! <laughs>